Now let's go into the Fortress of Magma. That's what those words look like. Okay. With Yoshi's Island music. Ah. What the hell are those things? They look like two-headed dragons. Okay, I'm digging the palace on those bob bombs with Char actually sniffets. Well, they act like them. So that's kind of what I call them. Um, I'm calling them Sniffits because they act like Sniffits, like they shoot a projectile. Okay, I'd like to be able to get up here. First power up we've seen in a while. That says something. We still got these two headed dragons walking around. Well, what else? Or maybe they're dinosaurs. I honestly don't know what they look like. Two-headed dragons, two-headed dinosaurs. Who knows? I think they just may be dinosaurs, actually. I mean, they don't have wings. Dragons have wings, those things don't, so I think they're dinosaurs. With two heads. Well, what else does it look like? They look weird, but heh, they're silly. And of course, okay, now we're just getting a lot of slow down here, and oh god, can I even beat this part of the level? Oh no. Is this doable? Or are these, this, oh, don't tell, oh no. That thing is freaking jammed. That thing is not gonna leave. So I guess I have to back up. Yup. Could have just wasted the power up just cuz yeah we're getting some pretty we're getting a lot of slowdown here actually it really a lot of slowdown okay now I screwed myself I've actually totally screwed myself here if I wasn't using safe states I'd have to reset the game there's no way to get out of this spin jump it doesn't look like there's a timer here I would have to reset the game or I could have just gotten hit. Wait, could you even possibly do this without taking a hit? Oh. You need to think to just... Wait, did I need that block for later? Yeah, I could have had to reset the game just because I was stuck there. That's not good. So Ninja Negro or some pretty significant flaws here and okay another accurate jump I have to make okay it's not as bad as the one in the castle you just saw like seriously the only reason I really died in that level was just that jump that thing is just stuck there these things just don't seem to move at all when they reach a slope the two-headed dinosaurs well they look like it so what else am I supposed to call them Oh no, now it's stuck again. The dinosaur keeps getting stuck. So, oh wait, I, it's not a ball bomb. I can't grab it and throw it. Oh, so, wait, I think I know how to do this. Unless if you actually have to slide into it. I thought it was a forced hit. It could have been. I wonder how many people are actually going to think to use those slopes to their advantage. Still. Seriously. Okay, we get a door. With more level, of course. And no midpoints, just level. At least you can slide into the two-headed dinosaurs. At least that works. Okay, that two-headed dinosaur is really, really... I don't know what he's going through. He's going through some horrific thing. Is there anything even in here? I thought for a second you couldn't reach that block. Yeah, you gotta keep. You gotta be fast enough to slide into these things. It's pretty ridiculous, actually. To just have to slide into these enemies. And the fact the levels are as long as they are. That, too. Still. They're, they're long as they are, and, of course, no midpoints. Because this game. Because the. Because people just don't know how to use midpoints these days. It's like freaking Massimo. But this is still more playable than that. The 
but level design is still more intriguing than that of Massimo. It's less flat, it's less empty, it's less bland. It's definitely more interesting. It definitely keeps you on your toes. But... It's hard. And it lacks midpoints, so really... I really don't have the patience for things like that. And okay, what are you supposed to do here? Okay, really, what are you supposed to do there? Okay, maybe I know what you're supposed to do here. Okay, what are you even supposed to do to make this jump? Okay, if I can kill the enemies, okay, if I can clear the enemies out of the way, okay, then, okay, let me clear the enemies out of the way, maybe then I could try We're gonna try and make a huge- Oh, fuck you, get out of there, freaking enemy! I'm trying to just get a- I'm trying to just build up speed to make a jump! Come on, I'm just trying to build up speed to make a jump! Which doesn't even work. So what, is level impossible? So what, does that mean your level's impossible? I honestly don't know how to make this jump! Oh, another pixel perfect jump. So that's what it is. No wonder I'm safe scumming. So many pixel perfect jumps, how are you supposed to make them? The fact that there's no midpoints, it's how far you're gonna get sent back when you make a jump that it's pretty obvious you won't be making it the first time around because of how much accuracy and precision it requires! And we have some more slowdown because of all the sprites. Okay, those things do die to fire, they just take more hits than, well... They just take... Okay, now there's actually a decent amount of power-ups here. I don't get it. Before, that wasn't the case, but now it is. In fact, the level before this one didn't even have a single power-up. No, I'm not kidding. It had no power-ups at all. Just, well... It didn't have any power-ups at all. Though I think one of those would have screwed you over when you were trying to make that pixel-perfect jump. That shouldn't even be an issue, but hell, it is. Okay, I did not see it was below me. Yeah, another blind jump. Except there, it's actually deadly. And it's a lot more annoying, too. Because it'll make you restart an entire level. These levels are still going on. They're long, they have no midpoints. It really seems to be a thing with hacks I play these days. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is with me playing hacks that have no midpoints and long levels. I don't know why I'm getting such freaking long hacks. This I just picked at random and BOOM! It's like Yoshi's Strange Quest, except it's a little stupider. Except this guy isn't as 100% brilliant as Yoshi Fanatic. It's just your average levels rather than unique things that Yoshi Fanatic was able to do. Except these have some actual flaws. These have, there was blind jumps, there's jumps that are just barely possible, there's pixel perfect jumps, yeah, I'm not even kidding. You saw the one in the last castle, and I'm gonna stop this video as soon as I, as soon as I can finish the level. Except it doesn't seem to want to finish, or maybe it does. I'm gonna get a boss. Except I don't even know how to fight it. Not great. Excuse me for just safe scumming. I don't even know what to do here. Do you jump on the boss? Maybe you shoot it down with fire. Oh wait, it's made of fire. It's not gonna work. How do you kill this thing? What's this thing that falls to the side of the screen there anyway? What's going on? I don't even know how to kill. Okay, okay, I actually did do something. You jump on it. You do jump on it, actually. I actually think I saw this boss before. Yeah, you do jump on it. It's a little hard to jump on it, but you do that. Except this is harder because there's lava to fall into. Lava is never a pretty thing. And this thing seems to be taking quite a bit of hits. Yeah, this thing just doesn't work. Nothing wants to die this Negro Ninja. I 
gonna say this Negro Ninja is having quite a hard time. Because, like, well, it's easy now that I know what to do. Okay, now it's getting pretty easy. Just got I wanna try and not mess this up. Yeah, this thing's taking a lot of hits before it dies. And now it's dead. Now what? Oh, another boss. Which drops flames everywhere. You jump on it. Now it's just starting to get unpredictable. Okay, oh, okay, now I changed the rules. First, I can jump on it, but then, all of a sudden, I can't. Man, these freaking custom bosses! Oh my god! Okay, now I can't. Sometimes I can jump on them, sometimes I can't. Just let me know what you're doing with the freaking rules! And put midpoints in your levels, that too! The levels are too long, and of course, they can never have- It's like the author doesn't even know what a freaking midpoint is! It's like you never even learned what that was! Did you ever see a midpoint? And did you ever play a game that actually had a midpoint? Did you actually have an example to follow? You probably didn't. I can't kill this boss because it just changes patterns. I can't follow it. Okay, now it's going to start dropping Goombas that I have to throw at it. And of course, it's all so uncontrollable, the patterns here, that I can barely even do anything! Oh, come on! Okay, now he throws bones. I I'm not gonna do this on save states. This is too ridiculous. No midpoints. Literally, no midpoints. I don't even think I saw a single midpoint the entire game. Every level was just a marathon! It was just a marathon of grueling difficulty with a few pixel perfect jumps that would just screw you over. We have some bosses that will do this and then. Oh, I thought there was gonna be a third boss. <sighs> oh my god. I'm not gonna do this now. What, what, what do you think? I've had enough.